I think it's pretty safe to say the holy grail piece of John Mayer gear is the John Mayer Signature 2 Rock. Back in 2007, they only produced 25 of these examples, making it extremely rare and highly sought after even when it was released. It just went super fast and they were gone. Only 25 of them ever made. I have never personally seen one of these ever listed for sale. Well, until now. Lewis's Guitar Boutique on Reverb just listed John Mayer Signature number four out of 25, and it can be yours for the hefty sum of 60,000 Canadian dollars or about 46,000 USD. And I know some of you out there will probably start commenting, how can anyone be foolish enough to spend this much money on an amplifier, no amplifier is worth this, or something like that. And let me just put it this way. Game Warren Jordans by Michael Jordan himself have sold for over half a million dollars and up. So when you put it into perspective, this is more of a collector's piece, an extremely, extremely rare piece of gear that isn't just for the everyday person to go out and buy, let's be honest. It's an exceptionally rare amplifier. It's extremely special. This is a big ticket collector's item. And like I said, it's a holy grail piece of gear. Obviously at the time of making this video, the listing is still alive, but the fact that these never go for sale as most people just are planning on more or less keeping them indefinitely, and the fact that he's taking offers, I'm not sure by the time this video goes live in the morning here that it might still be for sale, who knows, but it'll be linked in the description down below for you guys to check out. After I shot this video actually, and I'm just editing it right now, I went on Reverb just to search up old listings to see if another John Mayer signature amp was sold on that platform. And it looks like one did sell in 2014. This one was listed for 26,000 Canadian. So we're sitting at a little over double the ask price of this one, serial number four, that serial number 23, appears to have sold for back six years ago now. I don't know, but this is just an indicator of where these amplifiers are going, the fact that this at least was the last sale six years ago for one of these. So it's just gonna be super interesting to see what number four is going to sell for. Of course, the John Mayer Signature Amplifier, is it worth 10 times the price of a traditional clean like I have behind me? Looking at the asking price, it's about 10 times the asking price of a Turok traditional clean that you can just order from Turok right now. Obviously not, it's not 10 times the amplifier. And if you guys actually want to see a really great comparison between the Turok John Mayer Signature and the Turok traditional clean, after all, the traditional clean is the grandchild of the John Mayer Signature Turok, my friends Jake Lucemore and the London guitarist actually AB'd both amplifiers. So there's a really great demo you guys can hear. It's gonna be carded on the screen and linked in the description down below. I highly suggest you guys go and check it out. But just trying to put this into perspective for you guys, of course this amplifier, isn't 10 times better than the amp that now is kind of the production version of it. But this is just a collector's piece and that's why again, people are going to be buying it. Anyways, I just wanted to highlight this for you guys because in the John Mayer gear world, this is a really big deal. And I hope whoever ends up buying this amplifier has a social media account. Maybe they'll join the John Mayer gear lounge on Facebook or if they're already in it. Because like a lot of really amazing, awesome rare Ferraris, for example, that spend most of their lives or all of their lives underneath the car cover sitting in the aircraft hangar, a lot of really great pieces of gear like this signature two rock kind of end up with the same fate. Never getting seen, no one ever is ever gonna hear them, they're just gonna live in someone's private studio where no one will ever know where they are. So hopefully this amp goes to someone who's gonna share it with the world, share more pictures, tone demos, stuff like that. I think it'd be really awesome. I don't think that's the likely outcome, but I can hope that we'll just see Two Rock, John Mayer Signature number four out in the wild, and it just won't go to someone's private collection, we'll never see it again pretty much. There you guys go. Again, I just wanted to highlight this for you guys. I'm definitely going to keep an eye on this and hopefully we find out at least what it sells for to get a ballpark of what people are willing to pay for this amplifier. Again, I don't think this is going to last very long. So if you have the cash and have been looking for one of these, you might want to shoot an offer sooner <laughs> than later. And until next time, you guys, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you on the next one. Anyway, go ahead and click the subscribe button if you like what you see.